TJ, he's a better version of Mike Anderson, and I say that in a sincere form. My relationship with him is, is deep, and of course it goes way back to when I was a kid because, number one, he's my uncle. He's a huge part of, of why I'm here, why I chose to coach as a profession, and you know how to do things with integrity, uh, not only as a coach, but as a person. He played for us at Arkansas, Coach Richardson, and of course I was a social head coach there, but he played for us. So he's another guy that played it. Lived it. Having to work two or three times harder because your uncle is on staff, you had to prove your worth and, you know, and why you earned your scholarship. I think more than anything, you know, tribute to Coach Richardson who, who took a chance on me. He's been with me ever since I've been a head coach, and that's over 18 years. He's destined to be a head coach, he's an associate head coach, and uh, I just think he kind of takes charge. I did a lot of different jobs before I really settled on coaching. I did door-to-door -door marketing. I worked at a barbecue restaurant, um, just trying to find my niche in life. I figured I wasn't good at anything else but coaching. Like, it just came natural to me. He gave me an opportunity to kind of feel my way. Um, and I had, he made me, of course, start from the bottom. Uh, so I was, you know, fresh out of college and, you know, wiping up sweat, um, you know, doing laundry, doing those managerial things, starting from the bottom and earning my way up to the top. So, um, you know, he made me work for it. He called and said, hey, I think I'm, I'm gonna take the job at St. John's and would you wanna come? And I said, coach, New York? <laughs> you know, that was, my, that was my first words to him. And then he started explaining about, you know, the, the tradition and, and the opportunities. I feel like, you know, after being with Coach Anderson for 18 years on the coaching side and also playing for four years at the highest level that I knew what it takes regardless of where we were. Um, and it was all about just getting the right people around us and, and things of that nature, and, and I think we have. has a great, great eye, you know, not only for talent, but even in, when you talk about defensively and offensively in terms of the philosophy of, of what we're doing. He can relate to the players. You gotta have people that can relate to your players. You know, we, we preach family, so the guys we recruit, uh, we treat them as family once they get here. That, that kind of philosophy and, and way of thinking and doing things, it continues.